Hello YouTube, welcome to my first video. In this video, I'll tell you how to make your RPG Maker game look unique. Yes, I could have the, you know, topic, how to create a game in RPG Maker MV, but it already had about 118,000 results, so I'm not gonna do it. So, guys, today we are gonna look on five points that will make your game look awesome. So without any further ado, let's get into it. So this is the game we were talking about? Yes, how is it looking? You call me to waste my time? You told me that you made an awful RPG. Not expected from you, Harold. RPG together? Yes, but we're looking at app like that. The RPG Maker MV software. Why all MV games look like the same? The question is, how can I make my game look unique? That's a nice question, Harold. Maybe they've got the answer. Really, Navy? But how? I'll tell, but first let's go to work. Your game looks awesome. That's really kind of you. Then let's discuss today's topic. So here comes the number one. Have many, many, and many plugins. That sounds crazy to me. Jim is crazy. What's new in it? I didn't mention like that. And you need just stop kidding for now. I don't mean that go down with a whole bunch of plugins from the master list. If you know some coding, you can make your game like you want it to be. After all, JS isn't a difficult language. But I don't know how to code. I once tried, but it was out of my mind. In that case, you better download them from sites like Yanfly Engine and some random dude. You just have to give credits for the hard work. But everyone's help else have the same plugin out of mind, right? Great question, Harold. That's why RPG Maker MV has something called parameters. So our creative depth can allow us to change things like colors, booleans. Number two is up next. Put all your effort. Are you kidding me? I put all effort in my game already. We know it. It's actually the way you put your effort. For example, while making map, you need to imagine the real life. How would a cliff look? Think the character like they're alive. They would have likes, dislikes, friends, and foes. No hero can always win and go to find a monster cause he likes to be heroic. And the most important thing, you need to make your game in such a way that people have to say that you're not a gamer if you haven't played your game. Great! And here comes number 3. Think it your way. What do you mean by that? If you want to make your game something like Stardew Valley for example, you don't have to copy all the mechanics and make it a flow. That will make it no fun. Instead, create a, the game that you always dreamed of. Just collaborate your inspirations ideas with your Look like that. It's just a short one. Four is the next. I've got a big question before then. Why aren't your maps looking so different? I mean, you guys told me you don't know how to create new tile sets. Looks like you've toggled the next one. Resources. Resources are available on both RPG Maker MV Web and Steam DLC Store. Resources include many characters, character generator stuff, tile set, audio. 
title background, parallax map, and many more. I've also got some bonus content as well. Now the last one, but not the least. Forums and feedback. No, I don't like people coming to your game for the first one I've ever played. You know, Harold, instead of taking it as criticism, you should take it as points of improvement. And we are done. Me. I'd like to join the RPG together if you agree. Me? Yes, I only got you with you. But if I would like a novice like me to join, because I want people who make games with their heart. So subscribe if you want to make if you make your RPG with your heart. And dislike if you don't like the video. Uh, uh, and a comment down in the section below which we can improve. So that we could also get our points of improvements.